I'm Callie. I'm one of the Greater Regional Health Cardiac Rehab Nurses, and I'm going to demonstrate our stretches. The first thing we're going to do is tilt our head to the side, touching our ear to our shoulder, and hold for four. And then we go back up to the other side, ear to shoulder, and back up, and repeat. Last one. Now we're going to turn and look over our shoulders, so turn to the right, back to the front. Remember not to go too far to where it hurts, just to where you feel the stretch. One more each side. And forward, last one. Now we're gonna shrug our shoulders. So pull them up and relax down. Here's three, four, and one more. Good. Now we're gonna roll our shoulders forward. So we're gonna roll them one, two, three, four, then we're gonna roll them backwards, same thing, but opposite direction. One, two, and last one. Good. Then we're gonna put our arms out to our side. We're gonna do eight little circles forward. Last one, and then go backwards. Great job. Now with one arm out, we're gonna take one arm, bring it across our chest, bring our other arm up, and we're just gonna gently pull our arm and stretch right through here. We'll hold for about a count of eight. Good, and then open it back up to stretch, bring the other arm across, bring your arm up and pull. Remember not to make it hurt, just to where you can feel that light stretch. Good job. Now you're gonna take your arm, you're gonna raise it straight up. You're gonna put it down between your shoulder blades. If you need a little bit more of a stretch, you can take your other arm and just gently pull back. And we're gonna hold this for a count of eight, too. Great job. Put that one down, same thing on the other arm. Straight up, down, behind our shoulder blades. A little extra stretch, take that other arm and just gently pull it back. For a count of eight. Good. And this one I call the cat stretch. So you're just gonna bring both arms up, bring them up over your head, and bring them down. And you're just gonna kind of cross them across your lower back. And go back up. If it hurts your shoulders, you can only go part way up if you need to. Three. We'll do two more. The next one, we're gonna make sure we've got our feet um, a nice width apart. We're going to make sure our bodies are upright and we're just gonna to lean to the side and you should feel a stretch on the side. Remember not to go down too far, make sure you keep your balance. And then up, and then down to the other side. And up, I hold for about four seconds down each side and we'll do the exercise a couple of times. And back up. The next one we're gonna twist. If you wanna keep your arms down, you can. If you wanna look for some balance, you can have a midline. You're just gonna twist, keep your feet planted. And bring it back center. Twist the other side. Bring it back center. One more side, or one more each side. And one more. Last one here. Good. Now we're gonna go over to the bar and do some leg exercises. The first one we're gonna do is have our feet on the floor, just lightly touching the bar if you need for balance. 
and we are gonna stretch up onto our toes and stretch out our calves. So we'll do eight of those. Up one, down, two, three, four, four more, five, six, seven, last one. Good. The next stretch, we're gonna have one leg forward with both the whole foot on the ground. The other one we're gonna put back with just our toe. We're gonna to bend that front leg and we're just gonna stretch. Again, you don't need to put your weight on the bar, just um, use it for support. We'll hold this for eight. Then we're gonna stand up and switch. So switch legs. If you need a little more of a stretch, you can lean back farther and that'll give a little deeper stretch. Good. and back up. The next one, we're gonna put our heel down in front, toe up. Again, we don't need to be leaning, we're just gonna use it for support. You're just gonna kinda sit back in your hip and you're gonna feel a nice stretch through your leg there. We'll hold this for eight. And we'll switch sides. So again, heel down, toe up, sit back into it, and hold the bar for balance. And again, eight counts. The next one, find a good stance to where you can hold on. You're gonna put one leg behind you with your toe down. You're gonna keep your knees straight and we're gonna do five little leg kicks. So up one, two, three, four, and five. And then we'll switch, same thing. Toe down, knees straight, little kicks. One, two, three, four and five all right the last one on the bar for those that are able you're going to take bring your foot up grab your foot and we're just going to hold a stretch here for eight good and we'll do another one if you need to and you can only grab like your pant leg go ahead and grab that pant leg like you see and go up The last exercise we're gonna do, you're gonna try to find a, somewhat of a close spot to the wall. If you want a deeper stretch later, you can put your feet back, but we'll start up close. Put your hands on the wall and we're gonna do five push-ups against the wall. So in one, two, three, four, last one, five. Good job.